Hey everybody, I am David, and today I wanted to start a brand new video that's going to be a little different from my normal uh, videos. I thought it would be a cool idea to give awareness to voice actors. I think just like actors who perform on camera physically doing all that physical stuff, uh, they are great actors out there, you know, uh, Leonardo DiCaprio, uh, Tom Hanks, um, you know, the list can go on and on, I'm not going to name them all. But I do feel voice actors go underappreciated sometimes, and I don't think a lot of people, especially younger people, are interested in knowing sometimes who uh, some of these voice actors behind some of their favorite cartoon shows or favorite children's shows in general, uh, who some of these char who some of these people are behind the scenes, because I think a lot of them we hear a lot more often than we might realize, and I thought if we maybe honor them a little bit and get some awareness out there of who some of these great voice talents are. Um, that can maybe help them get a little bit more praise that they do deserve. And so since Rogue One is coming out this week, I thought it would be a pretty neat idea to start off with Frank Oz, who not only is a voice actor, he is an actor, uh, he's done some acting-ish roles, he's also so done some directing, he also puppeteers a lot of the Muppets and Sesame Street characters that he has voiced throughout the years, so instead of talking about all of this, uh, of each specific character, I'm just going to show you guys a couple of random clips of the characters he has voiced uh, throughout his legacy and who knows maybe he'll return as one of these characters uh, one day so let's get to it Psst. fungus fungus you like cars because huh? I got a really nice car you let me go I'll give you a ride in the car Please, Fungus. I'm sorry, Wazowski, but Randall said I'm not allowed to fraternize with victims of his evil plot. Ah, <sighs> this is great. Ernie's sleeping over at the Count's tonight, so I have the place all to myself. For once, I know he's not going to wake me up. <sighs> no surprises, just peace and quiet. I'll just settle in under my blanket and go to sleep. Perhaps I spoke too soon. But uh, some of you might like to know a little bit more about uh, our drummer, whom we affectionately refer to as Animal. Animal! That's his name, actually. Uh, Animal, I, uh, why don't you tell our audience, how long have you been playing the drums? Uh, uh... One... Two, three, four, five. Five years, huh? Oh, no. Waiter! Just a moment, sir! Oh, no. Oh, waiter! Not now, sir! Yes, sir! Waiter at your service, sir! Waiter, there's a fly in my soup. Could you do something about it? There is a fly in your soup in yeah. this establishment? Yeah. I shall do something about it instantaneously, sir. Yes, sir, a fly in your soup. Huh. I shall take care of that, yes. Let's see, a fly in your soup. Are you sure it was a fly, not a noodle or maybe a piece of hair? Let me see, I am looking in the soup, sir, and I do not see a fly in the soup. No, no, waiter, I believe I said in the soup, and you're looking under the soup. Oh, uh, uh, I knew that. I knew that. Anybody knows that. I knew I was looking under the soup and not in the soup. All right, I will now look in the soup. Thank you, thank you. You're yes, welcome. thank You're welcome. you. All right, in the soup. Let me see. Ah, uh, here, little fly. Not a, no, 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 no. I am looking in the soup, sir, and I do not see a fly. Waiter, you're looking next to my soup. The fly isn't next to my soup. The fly is in my soup. Of course, of course it is in yes, the soup. Of course. Do not accuse me of not knowing what next to and in means. Of course. All right, all right, all right. Just I will look in the soup now. Thank you. For this supposed fly. Hey, Fozzie, can you get that? I, I get it, Kermit. Hello, the Muppet Show backstage. <laughs> Who was it? 
the water department. Double pump jump! Hey, Fozzie, can you get that, please? Yeah, Kermit, I'll get it. <clears throat> Hello, backstage, the Muppet Show. <laughs> Fozzie, hmm? who was it? <coughs> the fire department. <laughs> I think this is what they call a running gag. Christmas Eve, too late for letter to Santa Claus anyway. So, me call him! Hmm. Let's see. Uh, North Pole area code. Uh, oh yeah. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Me get him on phone and say, Hi, Santa Claus. Cookie Monster here. Yeah, that's what me say. Yeah. Then, me ask him to bring me cookies. And me ask him to bring... To bring me... Two delicious round chocolate fudge covered cupcakes. Ah, appears angry. Angry? No, I am not angry. Your star is not angry. She is merely disappointed. Disappointed? Yes. You, you have not been honest with me, Kermit. I, I, I haven't? No. When, when you told me we were spending a week in the swamp, mm -hmm. you never said there would be snakes and spiders and... Alligators! Well, well, no, I, I was saving the best part for a surprise. Surprise? Hmm? Kermi, you are out of your little green mind. Well, well, well gee, Miss Piggy, you know, I, I was born in the swamp. My, my roots are there, and I, and I just wanted you and my other friends to see it. But uh, we don't have to go back to the swamp. We can, uh, we can go to back where to where to where you were born. The sty. You know where your roots are. Where pigs eat swill and wallow in the mud. Remember that? Huh? 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 Remember this? Huh? No. We'll never get it out now. So certain are you. Always with you, it cannot be done. Do you nothing that I say? Master, moving stones around is one thing. This is totally different. No. No different. Only different in your mind. You must unlearn what you have learned. All right, I'll give it a try. No. Try not. Do. Or do not. There is no try. So that was such a great amount of work that obviously he has under his belt. These are some iconic characters throughout our childhood, or at least my childhood. I've seen all of these things when while growing up, and I think with Star Wars, it's probably uh, the voice of Yoda is probably his biggest uh, role that everybody should be aware of. So maybe that's hard to measure because Sesame Street and the Muppets are very iconic. So with that being said, guys, I'm going to end this here. Hope you like this video. If you want to see more, let me know in the comment section below and tell me what other voice actors do you recommend that I should uh, do a similar video like this to. So until next time, guys, take care.